I just don't, I just don't want that. When have I ever said that he'll be at Christmas or Thanksgiving? You said that at my house one day, and I said not at my house, he won't. No, I've never said that. Well, next, Emma says Jenny was reported to the Department of, uh, well, DHS just last month. We'll talk about why when we come back. This is a very high-risk situation with this child being removed. And if they find out that you're in violation of this restraining order, they're very likely to take drastic actions. And later... At one of his court appearances, he asked me to leave. He was afraid that I would manage to get a gun into the courtroom and I would kill him. I would like for him to retain that image of me. The only thing I have to say to him, I'm waiting for you. Tomorrow, from nurse's aid to living in her car. I didn't put myself in this position. You quit your job, then you get evicted. I didn't get evicted. She thinks there's a conspiracy. Everybody was starting to act weird. The lady at the rent a car, people in my community. What's the common denominator? I'm not good at fractions. My blood is on your hands. That's when I was angry. Yeah, and you get angry a lot. Oh, stick around. That's nothing. That's tomorrow. You've just met him 15 seconds ago, and you're starting to fight with him. Then, on Thursday... I am obsessed with taking 100,000 steps a day. Is she obsessed with fitness? She spends 11 to 13 hours jogging every day in circles around her coffee table. That's Thursday. Close captioning provided by... For a cold sore, I use Herpes Enel. It penetrates deep to treat. It soothes, moisturizes, and creates an SPF 30 barrier to protect against flare-ups caused by the sun. Herpes Enel. Bumping us in, set, shot in with music and applause. Here we go. Emma fears that her daughter Jenny is a terrible parent who is putting Lee in danger. My mom does criticize me about how I parent my children. Jenny gets angry. She curses, rages out of control in Lee's presence. With Lee, she says that I am a little bit too hard on her, that Lee is nothing like Jordan. She blamed me for not disciplining him enough. My mom would tell me that he did beat his ass beat on numerous occasions. Jenny and her husband fight in front of Lee. So you're doing that in front of the baby. What are you teaching her? I do believe I made the right decision in adopting Lee. I think Jenny has a tendency to abuse alcohol because of her unhappiness. I feel like I'm a good mom because I would never, ever turn my back on my children, ever. I don't think you're seeing this clearly, but by no stretch of the imagination do I think you endorsed what he did. I want to be very clear about that. What I do think is that you have compassion for him and can make a case in your mind for why he would be the way he is. And as a result, I think you're more forgiving than an objective individual would be because this is your child. And I think you are allowing him to have an expectancy set that he's going to be able to reunite with this child. And when he gets out and finds out that's not the case, he's going to feel betrayed by you and could be a very high risk relationship for you at that point because he's going to feel like you've given him the indication that you know we can forgive and forget and move on uh, and that's not the case you don't have the right to do that that's not your decision anymore that was the court's decision the court's decision was that this is a very high risk individual for this little girl and I promise you the court's intention is not for him to see pictures of her not for him to keep the hope of that relationship alive. And it's, it, it's just not going to work well when he gets out and finds out that that's going to be enforced, and it is going to be enforced, because if you don't enforce it, the courts will, and neither one of you will have access to this child. If, if this continues, you may not be an option for Lee. And that's the issue that we get down to, because according to Emma, uh, if, if you experience anger and road rage and fights in front of Lee and alcohol problem and smoking marijuana and a suicide attempt in 2018 and a month ago uh, DHS was involved for you bringing Lee to concerts with alcohol and marijuana and leaving Lee home alone with a disabled husband. It gets to be a situation where the court steps in and says this is a, a 